guys and welcome back to my channel on today's episode i want to show you how i make coconut cake simple easy delicious yummy you name it to begin let me show you all the ingredients that we need we're gonna need butter salted and softened at room temperature we need eggs separated six egg yolk six egg white we need sugar coconut milk all-purpose flour and baking powder we need vanilla extract vegetable oil and plain yogurt to begin preheat your oven to 350 fahrenheit and then grease a pan this is going to serve 8 to 10 and this is going to be a very moist coconut cake that you are going to love it and so the pan is 10 by 13 or 10 by 14 inches so grease that well with uh, oil or butter and then line it with parchment so set that on the side and then i'm gonna use just a electric hand mixer and a bowl everything is going in here if you want to use your stand mixer like mine is right there i just i'm just lazy to bring it in the front use it and wash the bowl and put it back again because it's too heavy so just to make my life easy, this is what I'm going to use. So let's get started. I'm going to start by mixing or beating the egg white. And now you can see how the egg is looking. It's not fluffy so far. So I'm going to continue mixing this over medium speed and I'm going to keep adding sugar. Next, I'm going to add vanilla extract, two teaspoons, vegetable oil, one third cup, plain yogurt, half cup, and then I'm going to add three quarter cup of butter, give it a good mix. I'm going to add the egg yolk, mix. coconut milk we are like most likely adding all the wet ingredients and now i'm just gonna take a spoon and mix my flour and my baking powder together and then uh, a little bit at a time add to your butter to your wet ingredient and then we're gonna mix just until combined Okay, that's done. And now, oops, there's so much left. Okay, so just take a spatula as we always do. Mix everything once again, just before it goes in the prepared cake pan. And now you can see how creamy is the butter looking. If you have coconut extract, you can add that instead of vanilla because I don't have, I didn't add it because I know I have coconut milk. So it is still going to taste a coconut cake. And then later on, we are adding um, frosting. So now, as you can see, I'm pouring the cake on my prepared cake pan. And then uh, you want to make sure that you spread it evenly. And then this is going to go in my preheated oven, preheated 350 Fahrenheit. So let this bake and then I'm going to wait for the cake to, to get cool completely. All right, so my cake is cooled down completely. Just set it on the side for now. Now it's time to make the frosting. So I have my 35% as you can see, it is either whipping cream or creme fouettee that in French, 
so i'm gonna add this to my bowl 600 ml that's good enough so i'm gonna start mixing this off camera because this is going to make noise just until uh you will see how thick is this is going to be okay so halfway through i'm gonna add powdered sugar if you want extra sweet add more i i just add four tablespoon but again you can add a little more if you want it to be more sweet so if you have coconut extract over here add coconut extract i don't have so i'm gonna add vanilla extract and that's it now we are going to mix until it's all fluffy and now you guys can see how thick is the cream so my cake is here just make sure you take a knife and you run it all around the cake pan before you add the frosting so a generous amount of frost that is looking good and then uh, if you have shredded coconut you rather add that since i have coconut powder or desiccated coconut this is what i'm gonna add a generous amount again since this is a coconut cake and all I know is you guys are going to love, love this coconut cake. Just make sure, uh, pay attention uh, when it gets 40 minutes, just put a butter knife in the cake and see if it comes out dry. Then you know the cake is done. Otherwise, some oven is different. It can take between 40 to 45 minutes. And let's try to cut a little piece. Now you guys can see how moist is the cake. Since I have guests coming over, I'm not gonna make a mess. I'm just gonna cut a little piece. Hopefully I can get it. Okay, just a little piece for me for now on my plate. Now you guys can see on the inside and how soft is the cake written ingredient is down below in the description box i will see you next time with another great recipe for now bye bye